Hey, the old rules here, and welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. Um, I know that I said when I came back I'd have the uh, ingrowns for the irrigation system unlocked, but I realized that half the time when I do that and then I come to record a video, I have no idea what to do, so I decide to explore and then I end up getting eaten by Sarkos. Um, or worse. So, um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go around and harvest rocks. Uh, from various places along the shoreline. I'm going to use it to make um, ingots and I'm just going to get the irrigation stuff on screen. Another reason I want to do this is because I sort of need help with the irrigation system. The last time I tried to use this before I restarted my character to make videos for YouTube, um, I could not get the irrigation system to work properly. So maybe showing off the full process of how I do it will help um, somebody give me um, tips for that. And I did turn the uh, harvest modifier down a little bit. I turned it down to 1.5 instead of having it up at times 3. Um, just so that I don't get over encumbered just from a few rocks. And I am getting metal from these ones, so that's it. Okay, there we go. So, let me walk back over to my house and put some stuff away. Mainly the flint that I have. Hopefully I can find a use for it. In fact, um, what does it take to make the irrigation system? Just stone? Stone and wood some of them. Oh. Oh. Cementing paste? Do I have the cementing paste? No, I don't. Oh. Well. Okay, since I have three ingrams and I need it for that, I'll unlock it. But I noticed that um, I need a kind of hard to get item to make cementing paste. Well, hopefully I can find it. Um, the trilobite, the little creature that runs along the ground and then it runs away from you. Um, little bug-like creature that I've tried to get get the uh, material from. Um, are there easier ways to get chitin in this game? If that's how you pronounce it. I don't remember again. And where do I get keratin from? Same creature? Or from a different one? I'll just leave that be for a while. So let's put this flint away. I put stuff in this. Put the stone away. Um, I'm almost gonna put my hide in here too. I don't need to have that on me. I don't know why I have metal and drums on me either. Uh, put the charcoal in here. I'll keep some wood with me. And I'll go out and, and um, at the smithy, I'll do this. Oh, wait, no, wrong thing. Wrong thing. This is what I need to use first. Forgot. Let's do this and this. And actually, a thing of wood that I just put away in here, I need that. Oh wait, no, I didn't put wood in here. I do have extra wood somewhere though, right? No? I guess not. Uh, let me go get wood real quick. Oh, 
No, so I think I am right that the metal tools are more durable, even though they have the same health. They're just definitely not going down as fast as the uh, other tools I was uh, using. Okay, that should be good enough. Actually, hang on, I'm gonna take from this rock real quick. I don't think I can get uh, metal from these ones though. No, I can't. The ones you can get metal from, they have a metallic sheen to them. Okay, my food and water levels are good right now, so I don't need to feed myself or drink anything. Um, excess inventory, put this here, and light. Okay, I'm going to go out and explore. I'll stay nearby so I can uh, get the uh, wood that doesn't get used from that back. It doesn't take long to make metal ingots like I showed in the uh, last episode. Okay, usually rocks that are along the shoreline here will give you metal. probably take for one more before I get um, encumbered again. Actually, no, I can go one more. Hmm. Okay. I am going to walk back and uh, drop some of this flint off the and stone. in here. I'll take this. Put this in here. Put this in here. Put this in here. And put this in here. I'm going to close this just to make sure um, predators don't try to eat my uh, dinosaurs that are on the second floor. I don't know if, uh, if um, predators walking by the house with the door open will trigger that. I just don't want to take the risk. Just trying to see if there are any fish near the shoreline that I could possibly try. Um, to get meat and stuff from, I doubt it. How close am I to leveling up? Halfway there. It's a little bit more than halfway, actually. The bar shows halfway, but that's not what the numbers show. And 
this should be close to finished. All done. Transfer all. Okay, so let me put this in here. Um, I'll keep this with me. I'll put this in here. Oh, right. Before I go anywhere, let me grab the uh, charcoal that spawned from that and put it in here. Okay, so let's continue um, to gather supplies and stuff. Okay, I'm very close to leveling up. Great. white supply drop. I guess I could go over there and see what's in it. Probably nothing that I want, but something to do, I guess. I'll take from the rocks on my way back. Yeah, I was told, um, that thing right there, apparently that's a, um, a nest for one of the flying creatures that's around here. And I think if you destroy it, you can get honey from it. But that's if you don't get stunk to death in the process. Which I'm not willing to take the risk for, so I'm just going to ignore it for now. see any predators yet. I've noticed that um, some of the predator looking dinosaurs on this side of the island are the oviraptors, which will not attack you. They'll just run away from you. But from a distance, they look a lot like um, the Dilophosauruses. And I see that uh, bird that likes to Steel is over here. Is that a regular raptor or is that an obby raptor again? Either way, I could pop probably fight it if it is a threat. Yep, it's the obby raptor. Okay. I'm good. I'm not sure if the obby raptors will attack you if they're in a pack. Um... Like, most dinosaurs will just, um, ignore you unless there's, like, at least three of them. Like, the little compy dinosaurs. They'll run up to, to me and just stand there if there's only one of them. But once they get about three of them and they get the pack, um, up, um, the pack enhancement. Because some dinosaurs, they do more damage when they're in a pack. Like, the compies, then they'll start attacking when they actually have numbers. Not that it really matters, though. Hello. What do you take to tame? Measure berries. Hmm. That's something I could actually easily get and uh, probably tame that one. Let's see, what do you have? 
Absolutely nothing I want. Okay, great. Let me see something. Let's see if I can get medjo berries from some of the uh, things around here. Okay, well, there's one. Yeah, ten's definitely not going to be enough. How many metro berries will it take? Mm. I'm just gonna keep grabbing handfuls of uh, bushes until I feel I have enough metro berries. I might have to toss this uh, fiber that I'm picking up though. And because I'm on a hot spot, my water is going down like crazy. My hydration. So let's go over here and drink a little bit. Is that just ambient sounds, or is that actually something I should be worried about? I think it's just ambient noise. I hope. There we go. I know that this game had a recent update and maybe I mean I'm just now noticing it, but did it always show an icon of what the item you're picking up looks like next to the uh, added text? Because I swear that's the first time I'm noticing it. It's probably always been there, though. Oh, I'm encumbered. Whoops. Um, I don't need all of the uh, stone that I have, so I can drop that. Yeah, that's pretty much all that I want to drop. Yeah, that's freed up some space. Okay, I have 24 medjo berries. I don't think that's enough to uh, tame this uh, creature, but I can certainly try. Now let me see if I can find it. I'm just gonna take my pickaxe out just in case. Hey, Parasaur, what's up? I don't see that one dinosaur that I collected all those berries for. Oh well, probably 
I think those creatures have the capability of being able to swim, or I'm just having trouble finding it. But if they do have the capability of swimming, it probably swam to the other side. So I was sort of walking in this direction towards the water when I saw it. Oh well, I want to explore this side of the island a little bit more. Look, what time is it in the game? 15.44. Um, I'm going to stay out for a little bit longer before I... Oh, that's the first time I've seen a supply drop despawn. Okay. I'm going to stay out here for just a little bit longer. I don't know why, because anytime I decide to do this, I always end up dying. Oh, well. I've also noticed that these um, turtle-like dinosaurs, the uh, carbon nemies, I think that's how you pronounce that. It's probably not how you pronounce that. Um, like, every single time I hear them, I think that it's a threatening dinosaur, because I mentioned that in the last episode. But no, it's just that one. It's just that their heavy steps and shuffling of their shell just sounds really intimidating. take from this real quick just to get some metal from it okay so I'm over there now It's starting to get late, so I think I'm going to go back at this point before something bad happens. Okay, I'm almost to the next level. So that's a good. You know, I don't really understand why your character can't harvest while holding a tool. Because they're only holding the tool with one hand, as far as I can tell. They can't use their other hand to pick stuff up. Like the little rocks on the shoreline. Like, if I walk over one while holding the torch it says you bringing up fist or torch to yeah that's another thing why can I hold the torch and pick stuff up but I can't pick anything up if I'm holding my my pickaxe or hatchet does that also mean with the wooden club I also can't pick stuff up yeah yeah it doesn't work it's really, really weird. What makes the torch so special?
Hello, you. Are you the one that I was looking for earlier and I somehow just walked right past you? Yep. Wait until it's hungry again. Okay. How long do I have to wait until it's hungry again? Because I don't want its teeming bar to go away. Oh, I'm encumbered again. Oops. So it doesn't take that long. Cool. I don't know what the perk of having this dinosaur would be, but I want it. Oh, I see. It takes a little bit at a time. It doesn't... Oh. I just now noticed it's not using all of the measure berries that I have. This is a very tedious process. Why can't I just feed it the whole thing? Okay, so I think I have enough. Whoa, what was that? Flag spike. Yeah, I definitely have enough uh, measure berries to tame this thing. Um, Drop this, I guess. And I don't really see what's weighing me down. I guess this. Okay, so I'm just gonna stand on top of it, and whenever it prompts me to feed it, I will. Hopefully, um,. One of those thieving dinosaurs doesn't come by because if they do, they'll take my medjo berries because they're in the final slot of my uh, hot bar. Okay, almost there. Wait, am I literally feeding it one medjo berry at a time? Because it seems like it. That's the reason why I was going back to uh, collect more berries, because I just assumed that I gave it the whole thing. But apparently that's not the case. Okay. One more time should do it. And then it's a matter of getting it back to uh, my house in one piece.
<laughs> oh, that's cute. It's also stuck. That should be enough to uh, free it, I would think. Uh, behavior. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to disable following. Enable follow. Are you still stuck? Um, behavior, uh, stance, uh, neutral. Okay. Now, if I walk away, yeah. You're following. Cool, so I have a new dinosaur. Great. <laughs> I don't know why, but the small waddle animation of this dinosaur is making me laugh. Okay. I think I can just walk and you'll follow. I've never seen these dinosaurs attack anything, so I didn't think that they had the capability to fight. They usually just run away. Ooh, starting to get dark. We need to clear a path. Well, I do have a full torch to use, just in case I need it. It's another Avi Raptor, so I'm not going to worry about it. Oh, hey. Hi, you. I got oil from it. Ooh. Oh, so that's how you get oil. And I got something else, too. Silica pearls. Hmm. But I got the chitin, though. Nice. Let me look at my map just to make sure. Yeah, I'm going the right direction. Good. Okay, now that I know how to read the marker on the map, it's a little bit easier for me. <laughs> this dinosaur's run animation. <laughs> so yeah, it was completely worthwhile coming out here. I managed to get a new dinosaur at least, and I managed to get chitin as well. And item that I do need. Does chitin spoil? I don't think it does. Nope. 
What? 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 Oh, okay. You're all the way over there. Good. Whew. That scared me. Cause I, cause I knew I saw one of them over here before and I thought I was in danger. Cause I swear if it took my chitin from me that I just got, I would be really upset. there. Oh, hey, there's a salmon. I'd get that, but um, I don't really want to right now. Okay, finally home. I want to leave Jake inside, where he'll be safe. Okay, and I can put this out. I figured you got stuck on the side of the house. Come this way. Oh. <laughs> I can add a level to you though. Nice. Um, let's give you health and let's give you berries as well because uh, you need food. So let's do this and this. Oh, I have measure berry seeds. Can I make it follow me into the house, though? Jake? Jake? Because, like, when he gets a certain distance um, from me, he stops following. Let me try standing about here. Jake. 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 Okay, I don't think Jake can come inside the house. Okay, well... Alicia has a level. Okay. I'll go tend to that in a moment. Hi there. 
Oh, no, you almost have a level. You're very close to leveling up. And so are you. Cool. I don't understand why you can't can't get in the house. Seriously, stairs. Can you? Jake, 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 no. Wait, can you level up again already? What? 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 What was that? I have no idea what just happened. Well, that scared me. Let's increase your melee damage. Always walks around to the side of the house. Okay, I'm just gonna forget about it. You know what? You know what? Follow me over here. It's at least. Yeah, that's a good place for you to stand. Um, behavior. See, we'll follow him. Um, by the way. Enable following. Disabling following, that doesn't mean that you can wander away, okay? Oh, that's right. I got raw meat from that uh, trilobite that I uh, killed. I was like, like spo spoiled raw meat from what? Oh, whoops. I set myself on fire. Okay, that's a first. Okay, note to self. <laughs> Don't stand on top of the campfire when you're trying to cook food. Oh, I actually got him inside. Wow. Um, let me close the door. I won't be able to get him upstairs, but that's fine. Behavior. Um. See, we're following. Means he'll just wander around now. It's a good thing I'm cooking food, because I'm going to need it. Well, I actually have plenty of food, but while my uh, health regenerates, my food will go down, as you can see. But uh, let me put some of the stuff inside my chest. Like the silica pearls and the oil. 
I can't put anything else in there. Put the oil in here. Um, thick blob of unrefined oil can be refined with hide to make gasoline. Oh, okay. Cool. stone in here. Put the thatch in here. Put this in here. I don't need this or this. Or this. I have a lot of seeds. Okay, let me uh, go on ahead and eat. that bird eating fish outside. Oh. Wow. You've gained another level already. Actually, no. No, you haven't. Your thing is just green for no reason. Okay. Is this finished yet? It's not something about harvest settings. Sable vi victim item collection. Oh, so if I have Jake with me and I die, he'll collect my items for me? Wait, do all my dinosaurs have that? Oh, they all do. That's cool. I didn't realize that the dinosaurs could do that. Okay, I think that should be uh, good enough for this. Yep. Well, I used up all of the wood anyway. So I just want to check something. Uh, okay, my armor didn't get damaged from that. Um, from me setting myself on fire. Good. Okay, you know what? I think I'm going to go on ahead and end this episode here. Um, so yeah, I got a new buddy who I can pet, and he's really adorable. Um, but yeah, um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, give this video a like. Also, be sure to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter, as well as support my Patreon. All three links will be in the description below. Shout out to my Patreon, AZ159825. Thank you for supporting my channel, and subscribe for more. And if you are subscribed or a new subscriber right now, be sure to hit that bell icon so you get notified when I upload videos. This is Viola Rules, signing off. Talk to you later.